Welcome in guys, I am TS Villa, thank you for joining me. We are going to be playing Like a Dragon, Infinite Wealth. Thank you to Jake at Hello Guillotine and also Sega for the early copy of the game. It's been awesome that you support in the TS Villa channels. If you like this video, please don't forget to like it on YouTube and also subscribe to the YouTube channel, TS Villa. And also, I'm a Twitch streamer. Please check me out over on Twitch at TS Villa. Right, guys. Let's let's get into this, guys. Let's get into this. Right, here we go. New Game Plus has been added. I haven't even done the first game. <laughs> here we go. Right. Listen to the music, man. Listen to the music. We've got multiplayer mini games. If you are playing on PS4, you can obviously uh, upload your data here. And we've got some add-ons as well. Okay. So I can see one. I think I can see the other one as well. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Let's see what this is about. Listen to that rain. Listen to that rain. Please let me know in the comments if you are looking to play this game uh, or if you have already played this game. Mind the road now. There are dogs on the loose around here. We're out here awfully late. True, but I'd say the meeting was worth it. With all it's the a bit dark, isn't it? Days, there's no the brightness earlier. to feed. And tonight marks a big step forward in solving that. I suppose you're right. So no, but for dear, yourself? I did want to talk about Bryce. <laughs> what happened? Someone's out there. Who's that? No! Turn the brightness up a bit, guys. There we go. Are we finished? Time for your reward. Ha <laughs> ha! Always the way, isn't it? Always the way. Interesting. Well, I've um, I've never played these games before, guys. That's the disclaimer that I'm going to give you. I've never played these games before. I've seen them being played. So uh, this is my first time of actually playing this game. I'm expecting big things from the soundtrack as well, judging by the trailers and some footage that I've seen. The soundtrack is going to be pretty cool. The keyboard. I thought that was on a beach. It's a keyboard. Just how long is <laughs> They're this in an office. take? Uh, 2022. Oh, I'll be done any second. Just need to give this a once over. A right funky beat, isn't it? Do it. <laughs> funky beat. Your resume's in good hands, Sasaki san. <clears throat> my name is Ichiban Kasuga, and finding you work is my work. Now, let's get you something good. Thank you, Ichiban. Yeah, let's. Big celebrity ought to have big connections. I wouldn't say that. I really no big deal. <laughs> <sighs> Sigh. 
So, what kind of work you got for me, Kasuka-san? Well, before that, Sasaki-san. It says here you work for Moroi Industries. Yeah, that's what it says on the paper. To my knowledge, Moroi Industries is a what does that company mean? that processes <laughs> waste for a syndicate called the Hiwatashi Clan. All their employees are Yakuza. Hey, you know your stuff. It also says here that you were let go from your position there. If I'm not mistaken, this is because the business shut down after the Hiwatashi clan disbanded last month? Is that correct? <sighs> yeah, what about it? Taking into account that you worked at Moroi Industries and the fact that you have quite an intricate tattoo, can I assume that got a you're good eye, the next Yakuza who just recently got out of the trade? You're telling me that matters? You'll need to indicate that on your resume. Listen, buddy. What I did or didn't do before coming here is my own business. At the very least, it's information your employer deserves Guessing to he's know. changed, has he? Has he changed? <sighs> Come on. How about you drop the silly little act already, eh, Kasuga-san? You think I haven't heard the rumors? Rumors? About what? About you finding good work for ex-Yakuza, like me. Those rumors. People from all over have been calling you a savior. Afraid I don't know what you mean. I'm he's just a regular at him. guy at a he regular job. Off him, but he's shouting at him. I thought I told Madness. you to cut the crap. I don't have time for games here. All right, then. Let's start by rewriting your resume. Do you have any special qualifications you can list? Uh, they'll help you cast a wider net when... What I say? Knock that humble servant shit off. Oof. If I can ask you to please keep your voice down, the loud noises might be disturbing to the other customers. <laughs> He's so calm, isn't he? Look how cool he is. Sasaki-san, our job is to find the ideal match for both our customers and our business partners. However, with your behavior today, I doubt you'll be getting a job anytime soon. You may have left the Yakuza, but it hasn't left you. Ooh. I have no jobs to offer you at this time. I'll have to ask you to leave. You bastard! He's right though, isn't he? He's right. Mm. Is he going to be a good fit for the company? <laughs> that they're going to partner in up with? You got more to say. <laughs> Damn it! Absolute Somehow badass, isn't it? To be wasting my goddamn time! Apologies for the disturbance, everyone. We should be okay now. Next customer, please come to counter four. Go. Oh, uh, thanks. <laughs> now he's lost his cool. Nice work today, Kasuga-san. Uh, you okay after all that? Oh, yeah. It was no sweat. Didn't mean to make a scene. Sorry about that. Oh, not at all. I just feel bad you have to put up with all that. Uh, sorry to place it on you. Oh, it's all good. Really, I'm just happy I can make myself useful. It's the least I can do. Especially after you guys bothered to take me in. Wow. You really are the hero of Yokohama. We're glad to have you around. <laughs> Come on, you don't have to call me that. Why not? You exposed the crimes of both the governor and the police department. This seems to be a lot of talking at the minute, so I hope you don't mind me just no, like watching it really with you guys, listening, right. that was a while taking ago. in the surroundings as well. Well, we're proud just to share a workplace with you. You ought to be proud of yourself too, Kasuga-san. They love him. <laughs> Hey, I appreciate the kind words. Anyway, I'm heading out for the day. I'll see you later, yeah? Just take his tie off and that was it. Oh, here we go. So if you press the stick in, it's also on and off. That's pretty cool. 
So you can just either go, either I'll go for sit down place or play it safe and get a beef bowl. Find it out of the way, but I could check the restaurant on Central Street, then go for a beef bowl if I ain't feeling it. Okay. Well, here we go, guys. Let's move him around. This is what I do. I always check. You've received a new. Sweet mom. Sweet your mom? I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm butchering it, guys. Sorry for you big fans. Okay, this is all the um, DLC stuff. Okay, so we're just gonna. I'm just gonna have a look around. Some more stuff again. X to sprint or R button to sprint. There we go. Oh, look at that turning circle, guys. Look at the turning circle. What a hero. Okay, X is win as well. Have a good one. So he wants us to go to Central. Yeah, we go. This is West Central. Oh, what's this briefcase? No particular use, might be worth some change at a pawn shop. Okay, so we can collect random stuff to sell it at a pawn shop. So here we go, get this before that. Talking about a soccer rematch. Poseidon power, energy drink that boosts attack and magic in a fight. Magic. Yes, guys. We're collecting stuff on the way. Look at this. And my headset as well, you can hear. People talking, the sirens, the wind. Come back soon. He ain't talking to me, is he? Another briefcase, I love that. Any drink that boosts evasion and agility in fights. There's another one here. The car park. Medicine that soothes, burns and restores 50 HP. That's pretty decent. Anything around the back? Can we go up? I don't think the restaurant's this way. Okay, so we are we are following the path. We can't go off the path. Okay, see that purple bit there? Will it let us grab this? Oh, it won't. There's two briefcases there, guys. It's one for later. Drink the stores 15 MP. Okay. There's another briefcase. Will it let us go here? Yes, it will. This is me. This is this is a looter in me. There's the cures, common cold. Um, common cold. Okay. So they give like a little bit on top as well as the curing status. Okay, let's grab this. It's a bronze plate this time. Okay, right. So we're going in here. There we go. Something I can help you with, Sasaki-san. Oh no, you see we go. Huh? <laughs> Should have guessed. Uh, I just wanted to say sorry about before. I wasn't exactly reading the room. Huh? It's about money, right? I thought as much. You might be a savior. Gotta bribe his way in. People ain't free. Uh, uh, 50 grand ought to do it, right? <laughs> Got some fighting music going on right now. 50k a job, though. Damn good racket you've got there. Can't say I ain't jealous. You've got the wrong idea here. I'm not in this for myself. Huh? Hey, hold up. What's your deal? Uh, what, you want more or something? How much I gotta give you to get a job? The five-year ex-Yakuza clause. That's what's left you high and dry, right? Five years of red-taped hell follow a Yakuza on his way out. You can't open a bank account. We even rent some rat hole apartment. A cell phone plan's basically a no-go. Is that until the five Forget years up? Health insurance. Of course, it's made that much worse by the fact that no one wants to hire someone like that. Yeah, you clearly get it. So help a guy. All the people who are thrown out into Look the world after facial the expressions on them as well. Dissolved, are working their asses off just to get by. You think you can just slip a guy some cash and that's that? Get real, pal. Things don't work that way. Look, I didn't follow you out here oh. for a lecture. Oh, here Just we go. Take the stupid money, will you? Huh? Hey, cut it out! My money! Oh, what the hell, man? Uh. Rest now. Just take your money and go. Yeah! Quit acting all high and mighty. So badass. I love him. Just like me.
Here we go. The Let's have a fight. The battle is on. Sasaki, come on. Use your command menu in the bottom left corner of the screen to choose your actions in battle. Select attack. Perform a basic attack. Go on. Hit him with your best shot. Guess there's no choice. Let's cool you out a bit, huh? Four, five, seven. Quickly select attack before a down enemy gets up to strike them for heavier damage. Oh, we go. Here we go. That. 26. How do, we block? How do we block? Select skills to unleash a powerful ability in exchange for MP. Mental points. Your current MP is displayed in the green gauge at the bottom right. Okay, so I need to have a look at this before we do anything. Okay, my camera's in the way. Right. We'll sort that for the next video. Square. Perfect guard. Press circle at the moment you attack to perform a perfect guard. Decreasing the damage you take and lower the chance of receiving a status. Aim on. You can perform a perfect guard as long as you are able to act. Okay, so as long as you can act. Here we go. Oh. I was pressing circle then. <laughs> so it may be a bit late. You can cover health with items, so grab a snack if you need to fuel up. This, at last, this concludes the battle tutorial. Oh, okay, here we go. So, items. Uh, let's have some tuna. Chomp, 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 chomp. Perfect guard. Oh, I pressed one button. Oh, Bukert. Sasaki defeated. GG's. There might be if we play this game. We'll have to move the camera up. There's quite a few things. There's quite a few things to uh, to think about here. <laughs> On to the but next level. We've got some salmon. And we've upgraded as well, level two. Yeah, I'm looking at the uh, looking at the overlay here. We saw it come down here. Gotcha. What the hell's he doing? <laughs> <laughs> Look at this day. Oh, take a look. Your money's safe and sound. <laughs> oh, but at what cost? Oh, I think this suit might be a goner. <laughs> you ain't getting that clean. <laughs> That's awesome. Even after we beat the crap out of him, you're still like, here's your money. Here. Probably don't want to lose this, right? Hey. Were the rumors even true? A bunch of dudes told me you could hook me up. That you'd give me a job for 50 grand. While it's partly true, I am helping those who left the Yakuza find work. And as for that 50 grand, I did get that from someone about a year ago. Wait. And that means... But it wasn't for the job. I got a phone plan set up for him. He was just paying me back. A uh, phone plan? Mm. I got him a job at a pharmaceuticals manufacturer. They were looking for someone to help deal with resellers. Masks, cold medicine, antiseptic. Back when people were hoarding those, it left a suit. lot of others hurting. Whenever crooks like that try to cash in online, it's his job to put in fake bids and shut it all down. There are really jobs like that out there? It's kind of a gray area thing. Still, resellers are a huge thorn in those company sides. That's where the fake bids come in. Sort of tricky if you don't have a phone handy, you know? And as you're aware, ex-Yakuza aren't allowed to sign up. So you signed up for him? Yeah. Just to hold him over until he can find a better job. Ah. <sighs> Everyone's gritting their teeth to get through this thing. Plot thickens. I got no work to give to someone who waltzes up all cocky and shoves cash in my face. <sighs> it's tough, jumping back on the straight and narrow. I know. 
I went through all that life has to offer, just like you. I know how hard that shit is. But if you're prepared to try, to put your head down and crawl your way back up, if you really, truly want that, I'm right there with you. What do you say? You know, Don't ruin the when moment. you were down there gathering up all my money just now, I was sure you were going to steal it. But you didn't. I, uh, uh, well, for the first time in my life, I actually felt pretty, uh, pretty ashamed. It made me realize that I half assed just about everything I am. Please, please help me. Yes. I, I want to start over. I'll do whatever it takes. Good man. Okay, it's a deal. But do me a favor and stand up, all right? You're gonna be the one to do it, Sasaki-san. You're gonna put in the work. There all he I is. can do is give you a little push. Sasaki. Still, I'll do the best I can. Oh, thank you. Right then. Come on back to Hello Work tomorrow. All right. This here's your stipend. As to how you use it, well, it all depends on you. Wet money. Right. <laughs> You clean that off. Uh, he's got a look at his suit. Okay, time to eat. Ain't no way is he gonna go and eat. <laughs> you want to sit next to him? What a hero, man! Oh, some brand in there. Uber Eats. Oh, yes. I'm loving it. What a beat. Look at all these amazing people making this game. Right, so guys, I'm going to quickly do this here so that you can see. How does that look? So if we move it up a bit, then we've got there you go. That should be alright. We've got the panels, remove the panels. Yeah. Okay. You might still be able to see the um, uh, the radial menu. You know what? I'm calling it right now, guys. As much as I love Final Fantasy VII, uh, and we're having Rebirth this year, this is going to be up there with the best soundtrack of the year. I'm already loving it already. Has he got another suit? Or is he still wearing the same suit? Okay. Another day, another chance to make a difference. What a state. <laughs> right, what's this? Doing the best I can. Chapter one. It's a new suit. The other one was black, wasn't it? Nice, looking sharp. Here's hoping Sasaki actually shows up today. Guess there's only one way to find out. This is all in his head, that's why he's not saying it out loud, obviously. Time to head to work. Oh. I am new to this series, so I don't know the significance to having bananas by the shrine. Is that a thing? Let me know in the comments, guys, if that is a thing that is referencing these characters or previous games. Pay your respects first. Taking off now, boss. Young master. Can't believe it's already been three years since they both passed. 
Tojo Omi breaking up at the same time. They call it the Great Disillusion nowadays. Crazy, they went out during the peak of all that. You know, lately I've been so busy with what's in front of me. Might be good to reflect on how I got here. Let's do it. Reminisce. Yes, we do. We're reminiscing, guys. This is for me, and hopefully you guys are gonna need some of this. Let's reminisce. I have two fathers. First being the man who raised me, Jiro Kasuga. The other is my Yakuza father and old boss, Masumi Arakawa. I'm going to butcher these names, guys. I am really, really sorry. The boss was like a lighthouse to me. No matter the tide, he was always there, guiding me to shore. I want to repay him somehow, even if just in my own little way. That's why I picked his job. Find a place for all the guys left behind in the Great Disillusion was the boss's dying wish. Can't say it's been fulfilled all that well, though. No sweat, though. I'll see it through. Just you watch, boss. And the young master, Masato Arakawa. Arakawa? Uh, it's probably pronounced a different way. <laughs> uh, he was the boss's son, and well, to me, I guess he was like, I mean, really, we were like brothers, as far as I'm concerned. The young master used whatever dirty tricks he could to move up in the world, but those fell through. Heck, at one point he was planning to end it all. To think I talk him out of it, he was ready to start over, to keep on living, and even then, someone took that away from him. The bastard who did, this guy's name's Kume. He tried to escape, but they eventually caught him. He got busted for all the other crimes he committed too, and while he didn't get a life sentence, He's not going anywhere anytime soon. Kume was a monster of the young master's own creation. Most people would probably tell you he got what he was coming to him. I'd rather not see it that way, personally. Even now, I still wonder how things might have been if he'd survived. If he'd been given that chance. Alright guys. If you know me, I'm T.S. Miller. And I, I struggle to read out loud. So, thank you for bearing with me. Shoot! I shouldn't bum myself out before work like this. All oh, right, it's almost time to go. Got to give it my all in the office today. Let's go. The boys. The boys and the bananas. Oh, what's this cooler? What's in it? Item box. You find an item box in your hideout, at hangouts, and throughout various dungeons. At dungeons in the game, accessing them will let you store or take. Oh, so we could just put stuff in here, and then yeah, we will put stuff in here, and then we'll, we'll have it later. So that's when we run out of uh, run out of space. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, left stick, first person, third person. Okay, we'll stop doing that now. Simple wrist wristwatch. Looking good. Tell me about it. Look how stylish she is. Is it going to tell us to? I'm, I'm just randomly running around now, guys. Uh, yeah. Okay. Let's, let's see what's down here. Me being nosy, guys. Grab paper plates. Ah, oh, okay. Little water. This is pretty cool. Does that mean I can go in? No. The adult shop. You don't say much. Welcome. You got a jumbo sausage? <laughs> Look at this! Bamboo broom. Some boots. Uh, white briefs. Or even underwear as well. Got my sweatshirt made with stretchy fabric. Oh, I like the hoodie. I'm a hoodie man, guy. Let's get the hoodie. Yes. Let's see what it looks like with a hoodie on. 
and these aren't for him. This is, well, look at this. Look how much these are. Give him some new boots, rubber boots. There you go. And jumbo sausage. These are the weapons. For some reason he doesn't need the briefs. Arigato. There we go. Right, let's look at the menu, guys. So we've got tasks. Oh, I've moved the camera. Skills, items, gear, party, smartphone, bonds, personality. Um, what is this? Bondoko Island. Is it pronounced Sujimon? Okay, and then we can save it. Okay, so we've got the gear here that we have uh, put in. Uh, he's barehanded. No gear there. Is there stuff we have to pick up from somewhere? With the DLC stuff? Yeah. But he's got a hoodie on. Oh, it's all connected. And there is shiny stuff to grab, so it's not just briefcase. There is a briefcase. Have a Poseidon drink. There's stuff everywhere, man. This is a looter's dream. I'm gonna, it's gonna take ages to get to a destination, man. If this is a, uh, this is how it is. Look, look, there's just briefcase everywhere. Food that restores HP. Slowing down a bit. The little up here as well. I love that. That from here. Silver plate. You know what? We can do all that off stream, can't we, really? So, let's go to the destination. There's a vending machine here. What's this? Oh, I've knocked someone's bike over. Sorry, dudes. Okay, so we got a side in here, peach step, and a coffee. Increases money obtained from battle. So we drink that and we get a, we get extra money. Sorry, dude. Can I pick his bike up? Suga. The heck was that? Is this one on the floor? Pretty loud, isn't it? Huh? Hamako san? What happened to you? Oh, Ichiban. You're a sight for sore eyes. I almost didn't recognize you there. Cleaned up quite nice since I last saw you. <laughs> well, not much has changed on the inside. Anyway, you fall <laughs> or something? Yeah, sure did. Was just capping off an all night bender and, well, my legs give out. Do yourself a favor and don't get old. Impossible, isn't it? Tell her to ease up on her drinks, on the drink, or lend her a shoulder. Lend her a shoulder. You gonna be okay? I don't mind walking you home. Huh? Kindness. Oh, fine. Okay. It's not that bad. Actions. I get effects. little bumps like this every day. I'll just walk it off. You sure? Doesn't seem like a little bump to me. You're imagining things. Besides, don't you finally have a job? If I were you, I'd get there on the double. What, and leave you to limp on home? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not some invalid. I can take care of myself just fine. Now go, run along to work. After all, steady income isn't something you could take for granted. You know that, right? That's right. I know. Just... Go see a doctor when you can. I will. Thanks for the got a cool jacket. Kasuga's personality is represented by the following traits. Passion, confidence, charisma, kindness, which we've got here. Intellect and style. 
refining Kazuga's personality will earn him many perks such as increased resistance to enemy skills and status ailments as well as access to new facilities. Okay, personality chance is an opportunity to improve Kasuga's character. Different stats will raise depending on your selections. There are also many personality cha challenges which boosts your traits upon completion. Check them out via the pause menu. We will do in a minute. Okay, here's the pause menu. And here's personality. Right beneath me. Right then. Let's grab this from the bush. Briefcase here. Man, there's stuff everywhere, isn't there? Wristwatch. What's this guy? He's, he's having to think. Today's payday. So, should I buy some from my mum before I go home? I don't finally have a job. Okay. You do that, dude. You do that. Are we going upstairs? Another vending machine there. Oh yeah, this way works. Come in guys. Sorry I'm late. I assume I'm late. Everyone's there. <laughs> Alright then. Good luck with your interview. Thank you. Next in line, please. Oh look at this um, beast. My name's Shinya Sasaki. A pleasure to meet you. Welcome. Take a seat. Did you happen to bring a resume? Yes, sir, I did. Is that the code name? Is that the code name for X Yakuza? Sasaki-san, may I inquire about your criminal record? Mm -hmm. uh, it was theft. Watches and cosmetics and the like. I would steal anything valuable I could get my hands on so long as it was small enough. I had a buddy who found him. Look at the market, size of him. So Absolute beast. I, I see. Does that uh make things too difficult? Sasaki-san, may I ask you something? Sure. I don't see any record of punishment on here. In that case, why put your criminal history at all? Because I did those things, sir. Oh. If I'd hit my record to get a Honest job, ma I'd only make trouble for the company if it ever got out. I really want to start fresh. I can't go around acting like that never happened. That's a great way to think about it. He's getting his On job. Note, He's getting the job, guys. I have just the job for a man like you. Really? What kind of job? Well, simply put, shoplifting. Hmm? See, security guard. Is that what he means? Was he testing them out? Shoplifting. extra hand? Or has he got a fake hand? Um, excuse me. Would you be a dear and point me to the mouthwash? Uh, oh, sure. It should be right this way. He's got a fake hand, doesn't he? A fake arm. Ah, they're in it together. Here we go. He's had a busy day, hasn't he? This is tough. Hey, hey, hey. Pardon me, but do you think I could see this up close? Sure, one moment. This, this is an interesting job, isn't it, that he's given him? Good eye. This one's a top seller. Isn't it just perfect, honey? It's nice, but it's almost time for the movie. 
We should take a rain check. Oh no, it's that late. We'll swing by after. No trouble. I hope to see you again soon. Knows, she knows it's them. We're all done on our end. How'd it go? Got everything you asked for. What is going Plus on, man? A couple other big ticket items for good measure. Ah, damn. Glad I went to the pros for this one. <laughs> I thought he was giving them proper jobs. Shoplifting isn't a job. I need to know what's going on here. Okay, sunglasses, some cosmetics, a wallet, condoms. What else? Long story short, every shop had a ton of blind spots. What with how they were set up. Of course, it's been ages since somebody had to rely on me. A fake arm routine. Get mm. caught pulling something like that, and uh, there's not much you can say. That's why it's common for thieves to uh, work in teams nowadays. Usually, that means two roles a lookout or a decoy, and then the thief. A little division of labor can go a long way. Is it a security film? A uh, smaller cut in exchange for safety, huh? Well, it certainly beats jail time. Good work today. I'm heading home. Hey, you as well. Hope I can count on you again. Yeah, thanks for everything. Oh no. This was my first time helping someone steal something, so I was really nervous. Anyway, I'll see you two later. See ya. So, that's why you were saying you needed a hand. Yeah, the job's much easier for two than it is for one. She made for a pretty great actress, too. I guess listing the job as extra worked out. Better than we could have hoped. But I gotta say, I'm pretty impressed with your performance. He's good. You really He's know good. your stuff. Although, that last shop you hit up, from the look of it, they put a lot of money into their security system. The shop itself was fairly small, with cameras in every corner. Not only that, there wasn't much in the way of cover, meaning little to no blind spots. So how'd you swipe a high-end wallet out from under them? Well, sometimes those stores have fake cameras, but I could tell these were the real deal. We were also the only customers, so the shopkeep always had an eye on us. <sighs> that said, there was a camera above the register, and it was pointed more downwards than the others, meaning it wasn't getting a full view of the floor. Maybe they wanted it to focus more on the register, or it was just a mistake during installation. Mm. Clever. But either way, that right there was our blind spot. No kidding. Well, once I saw that, all I had to do was play the waiting game. Of course, the shopkeep realized what went down the moment we left, but the cameras got nothing on tape. Uh... The deed had already been done. You really figured out all that on your first trip and made off with some goods to boot? <laughs> I think I like this guy. I'm just amazed there's a job like this out there, especially considering my past and all. You know, they say 1.2 billion yen worth of merchandise gets stolen every year. Now, for most retailers, it's a life or death issue that could sink your business just like that. And despite that, a lot of business owners think all they need is a security guard or a few cameras. And that's just not true. All that really does is add a few blind spots you didn't have before. In fact, it could actually make it easier to steal things. Right. That is where we come in. It's our job to sniff out the gaps. Makes sense. As you might have figured. Oh, makes sense. If you'd failed today, that would mean their security systems were all squared away. I but thought there was something fishy going on there, but then see. I thought, that's a bit weird that Ichiban would yep. say that. And from here, I'll summarize their security flaws in a report and submit it to their managers. Now, that should do it for work they hired us for, but for my money, there's a real business opportunity here. Uh, meaning? 
Meaning now, I can offer them consulting, get a contract going, and I can advise them on where to place cameras or even introduce them to reputable security companies. Huh. Makes sense. Actually, once I uh, get this business off the ground, I'm thinking of starting up my own security company. Uh, the goal is to have a firm that can handle everything from investigation to consultation to basic security. Your man's got a job now, isn't he? Wow. He's gonna offer him a job. Howdy, fellas. Hey, Kasuga. Well, Adachi-san, how's Sasaki working out? Uh, if you ask me, he's a real pro. Already can't afford to lose him. Can I take that to mean he's hired? Yep. Glad to have him. Ah, thank you. I know I have a lot to learn, but I promise I'll work real hard. Hey, hey, hey. Look, your days of bowing like that are over, pal. Oh, sorry. Force of habit. <laughs> we'll make a working class civvy out of you yet. Uh, what's the book? <laughs> oh, I found this over at a nearby bookstore. What is it? Security industry certification. Right now, all you can do is steal and investigate. But that won't be enough. I was thinking you could study and get yourself certified. That way, you'll be ready to help out when Adachi-san expands his business. Sure, yeah. that'd be a big help. Give it a read when you get some time. Uh, Kasuga-san, tell me, what's your goal in all this? Huh? I mean, at this point, it's just weird. You must want something, right? Who goes that far for a stranger? Nope. You don't have some ulterior motive. Motive? Well, I, I guess you could say that. This is actually my way of repaying a debt. A debt? And everything I've done is what my patriarch in the Arakawa family was trying to do. Arakawa. It's the job he left behind when he passed on. He wanted to build a safe so place stylish for all in this game. Yakuza, I love it. Those with nowhere to turn. Carrying out his will is everything to me. More than that, it's my reason to live. Still, I can really only handle a tiny piece of it. <sighs> all in all, I'm just doing whatever I can. For real? <laughs> Man, you are one of a kind. Anyhow, I ought to get going. Do right by Adachi-san here, okay? So soon? Come on, you just got here. Ah, I've still got work to wrap up. All right then. Good luck That's with everything. That's a pretty cool story, isn't it? That's a pretty cool story for him. Thanks. He's still on the clock? I never knew Hello Work was so busy. Nah, Hello Work's done for the day. This, something a little different. Huh? There are a whole bunch of former Yakuza and Ijincho that Kasuga's helped out, same as you. Once he's done at the office, he typically heads out to check in and see how they're doing. Nice the two guy, biggest Yakuza organizations in Japan, the Omi Alliance and Tojo Clan, were completely dissolved. And that day, no fewer than 30,000 Yakuza were spit back into the real world. A lot of them likely couldn't find work and were left with a whole lot of options. Kasuga, he's dead set on rehabilitating every last one of them. Every good single one? Good man. Is that even possible? Well, not normally, no. But seeing him give his all, well, it makes me feel like even the impossible is possible. It's hard not to help out a guy like that. Yeah, honestly? I think I feel the same. What a story. How is, how is that for an intro, guys? This needs to be opened up right Someone text me. Oh, it's Namba. Remember, we're meeting at Survive tonight. Don't be late. Shoot. I was so busy with Sasaki, I almost forgot. Thanks, number. You better hustle over to survive. Oh, she's winning. Right, guys, before we go to uh, survive, I guess we will end 
this video. Let's make sure we save it. It's auto saving, but we will actually save it here. He's level two. All right, guys. Let's go back to the camera. How awesome was that, guys? That was like a dragon, infinite wealth. That was part of chapter one. So we saw a bit of the intro, then we had chapter one. Uh, thank you, Jake and Hello Guillotine, and also Sega for giving us a copy of this game early. It's been awesome to run through it, and also this story. This story is very intriguing for what's going on. I'm, uh, I've got high hopes with this game. Soundtrack, awesome. Massive 10 out of 10 for the soundtrack already. That's, that's, that's amazing, guys. Uh, let me know what you thought of the video. Please give it a like and also subscribe to the YouTube channel if you haven't already. Again, I'm a Twitch streamer as well, so please follow me over on Twitch. Uh, thank you for joining me, guys, and I will see you guys next time. Take care, everyone. Goodbye.